They're all pretty good into Cobalion too. It's really, you know, there's a handful of Pokemon that give you grief, but the team is very playable. So, um, yeah, why don't we try it? Why don't we give it a whirl? See what happens. It's good into Crest too. All three Pokemon usually beat Crest. So, I think we try it. If we win with it, uh, you save swap the Croc because it has good it has good coverage profile. All right, Gudra. Good luck, friend. What do you got? Uh, Greninja into Heliosk. That is a new Pokemon that I don't actually... really know what it does. I know it has Breaking Swipe. And I know it's flimsy. Uh, I'll probably switch from here. The downside being is that uh, it means they'll probably get to breaking swipe this. But I think I'm okay with that. Hopefully they're not on like, uh, yeah, breaking swipe is fine. Ah, that's a, that's a bad beat. So one of the, the Pokemon that's really good in this team is Tapu Fini. Breaking Swipe, Trailblaze, or Thunderbolt. Thank you. Feeny is a menace for us, unfortunately. Although letting me get all of these Shadow Balls off has been pretty good. Um, it puts us in a spot. I, like, I'm hoping we CMP'd here. It's a real bad play on their part. Oh, it is. Wow. Okay, perfect. Um... So how do we win from here? We've got some awkward things that need to happen. There's some awkward things that need to happen. Oh, they're already at the breaking swipe. Okay. Ow. Oops, that didn't work. <laughs> All right, well, that backfired. I was hoping that that would, uh, that would work out. We needed the energy. And preferably not to be debuffed like this. Can I one-shot whatever's in the back? And it's still also that Feeny is uh, barely alive, right? Uh, they could also catch right here, which would be unfortunate for me. Now nah, we'll die to that Shadow Claw. Well, unfortunately, the Tapu Feeny is kind of the, uh, the... Oh, I don't actually have a Helio, do I? I could make a Helio. I guess we're playing Helio. I just realized that that's a... Uh, and then Tapu and then Trevenant. Fascinating. Uh, so we need to make a Helio. Luckily, I have the... Uh, I have the Ultra League one saved, right? That's the Great League one. What are we talking Stardust wise here? Let's let's see what we're talking Stardust wise real quick. I think in hindsight we should have I we were we were in trouble no matter what with that Tapu back there, but let's see. Uh it's not cheap, but it's not the worst thing in the world, right? And it is stupid. And I have the Stardust, so you know what? Fine. You know what? Have your have your stupid Stardust. We'll spend a bunch of Stardust today. Oh, I'm under 10 million again. Uh, I regret everything. I already regret it. 
That put us under 10 million. <laughs> uh, we don't want mud slap. I do think we want the uh, the volt switch. There we go. We definitely want breaking swipe. Parabolic charge is bad, right? That's not the move we want. Can't remember. I feel like uh, hey, what's up, Fistafuri? How you doing? I want Thunderbolt or Trailblaze. Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. We'll we'll go we'll go on uh, oh, it's got Bulldoze too. It's got Bulldoze though. You sure you don't want Bulldoze? Does seem like a nice stab. Oh, it's 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 Electric Normal. Uh right it's not electric ground i think i thought it was a ground type you know what it's not it has i definitely misplayed that game badly i thought it was a ground type i just totally thought the thing was a ground type but we'll go thunderbolt we'll go thunderbolt you want the grass move for swampert ah that's not a bad argument it's not a bad argument. I think I I think I believe you. I think I believe you and I think I'm going to go go that route. Let me uh let me let me get there. Let me get there. I actually think I like that cuz otherwise I think you are a little bit There we go, grass not. I I'm glad to have all these rare XLs. I just don't know what to do with them yet. So I've just been saving them. <laughs> uh I I have no idea what I'm going to do with them. I mean, I'm going to max something at some point, but I just don't know what it's going to be. Helio Dragonite. Okay. I like to think that this matchup's kind of okay for us, right? Yeah, you know what? I'm going to let this go through. Dragon Claw on the debuff is fine. Because if that works out for us... Verizian. Okay, perfect. Although, how does our team... I, oh, no. We actually do have a good Verizian matchup back here, don't we? We do have a good Verizian matchup. As well as a pretty excellent Charizard matchup. GG's. All right. That worked out for us. We won the lead, and that was all we really needed to do to win the game. Depending on the Verizian moveset as well, it's very possible that we would have been okay core breaking there, but... What's up, uh, Profit? How you doing? All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. So, that was... Uh, Dragonite, a Pokemon I do not enjoy playing, but hey, it it is it is what it is. Uh, Charizard and Verizian. Sure. Let's run the run that one, and let's make sure my Charizard is the right Charizard as well. Cool, 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 cool. Let's do it again. Oh. I don't generally... Uh, well, I was in Amsterdam the whole time, so I all my videos were recorded before. <laughs> uh, Swampert, fine with me. We found ourselves a lead we like. We found ourselves a lead we like. Oh, we're, we just go into the mirror... They're going to haul off and blast burn me, maybe. Okay. Just does a whole hell of a lot more damage. Yeah. Also, like, I fully expect them to, uh, to do that and take the shield, given the circumstances. Um, 
But we actually have an even better matchup for this than our Dragonite. I mean, basically Swampert does nothing against our team, right? At least as it stands. But we're not shielding anything here. The question though is, do we, I think we, I don't think we show him the Verizian yet. I think it is in our best interest to just come back in with Dragonite. Yeah. We'll definitely be able to tank an Icicle Spear, right? I mean, I played Sunshine Cup yesterday. I don't mind Sunshine Cup. I don't think it's a, I don't think it's a terrible format. But I played uh, I played a day of Copycat and Sunshine Cup, and it was fine. What I don't like is the amount of. Uh, I don't like the amount of energy we've given up here. Okay, good. It doesn't matter. Never saw anything like that. Plus, if you uh, if you just copycat, it's a good old time. It's a good old time. And hydro cannon. Yeah, it's gonna take more than two hydro cannons to kill me. Um, so we're going to be fine. I think for Sunshine Cup, Copycat's actually pretty good because it just, it takes the pressure off. You're not trying to like crack anything. You're not trying to like figure out what's the best. You're just like, whatever. We're just going to see where it goes. Just play well. And it felt like Sunshine Cup in many ways was, was a format that benefited you if you just wanted to play well. All right. So that team was Swampert. I'll run the shadow. There was a Wall Rhine. And there was a Charizard. All right, we can uh, we can make this work. Let's try it. Let's try it. Let's see if we can find a winning set with uh, with this dub wool. Uh, our back line doesn't love double, so I think we're just kind of priced into, uh, kind of just priced into staying here, right? Hmm, what do we want to do here? Like, a payback would hurt. I wouldn't expect them to. I'd expect them to try and body slam us out. Oh, they actually did go payback. Okay. Oh, good catch on the Verizian. Well done, well done, well done. Um, I think what we want to do here... I don't love this, but we are up a shield. So the nice thing here is I can, uh, one, I can do a whole lot, which the first thing I can do is just force them to have to use this other shield, which feels real good. Nope, they did not. Okay, perfect. We've got energy as well as uh, an extra shield. We know they're on payback, but they're not on wild charge unless they're on Payback Wild Charge, which would be a very unusual move set. They are. They are on Payback Wild Charge. Oh. Hmm. What a mad lad our opponent is. All right, and their last Pokemon is this idiot. That was one, I think. Two. 
three. Okay. We'll catch this. What I'm trying to figure out is if we want to blast burn it. Actually, I think we're uh, I think we're relatively safe to come in with this and just earthquake them out. I don't think they can kill me before I get to an earthquake. A catch is something that has to be on my mind here. Uh, a sort of return on the favor. Because they're going to be pretty close here to being able to catch. So I think we're going to be a little bit cautious about when we throw here. And not throw exactly on schedule. Yeah, there we go. We still have to throw a move into this thing, but we are not going to throw the whole last earthquake. And that's really all that matters. Right. And then we're good. Clean. GG's. We get to play Greninja again. Yay. <laughs> I like playing Greninja. Greninja was a little bit of an awkward mon to find back there, but hey, you know what? It's all good. It's all good. Um, so there was a double. They had the double in the lead. Actually, I don't have a double. That's a Pokemon I don't actually have. So we're gonna need a we're need a, gonna need a sub for the double. And then their back line was Greninja Verizian. What's our uh what's our sub for the uh the double right now? Snorlax? It could be Snorlax, yeah. I don't mind Snorlax as an option. It's pretty it's got comparable stuff going on. Or Greedent. Ah, uh, I think it's Greedent. I think it's Greedent. Yeah. Okay. I think we do Greedent. We've already got the winning set locked, so that feels good. Let's see if we can get a fourth win. Hundo Vigoroth. You know, I have that. I don't have the XLs for it, though. Uh, Swampert. Okay. I do kind of wish I was on Bullet Seed right now. Not going to lie. I do kind of wish I was on Bullet Seed. Also, our whole team is kind of good into this thing. So it feels kind of bad to play this. Like, I kind of want to try and catch a... Uh, a move here, right? I want because I both my back mons resist this, so it wouldn't be bad to try and catch a uh, a move. I don't think. Ah, good discipline by our opponent. Good discipline by our opponent. We are on the move set that can hit this though, so that part's good. Right. But I don't think I can really afford to uh make sure we get the shield. They'll either no shield this and die and I'm okay with that or we'll get the shield and get to put greed in on this thing which is just yeah okay perfect it's a good farm for our opponent though good farm they'll be able to put some pressure onto our greed in here but not a lot let's see what does seed bomb do oh, that bonus damage on seed bomb uh oh shit Actually, it's not. I don't think that's a particularly good shield for us. We did get the move there, though. That's nice. All right. It's going to kind of come down to whether or not we can find a way for uh, for our boy here to uh, carry. If they've got a good uh, Greninja counter in the back, I think we're in trouble. But if this thing is a, a, a core breaker for him. Oh, we got a boost. That helps. 
Boost is nice. Um, we're definitely shielding this. Now, the question here is, do we win this race? No, okay. And then into Wall Ryan. Okay. What do we do here? I mean, I don't want to... Uh... Actually, we should be going body slam here because uh, the crunch won't kill him. And now all they need is the two moves. And we could have, we might have been able to double body slam. But spear gets me. Yeah. All right. They're going to, they're going to get me, I think. Because I think spear will get me. It's real close. Spear. Oh, tragedy. GG's. I think there was probably a way for us to f to get there at the end there, but it was just hard to figure that out with the timing and such. Um, and maybe also in hindsight, per like we spent a shield on that Greedent that I don't think totally returned on investment. So 